Hey guys, McGray here, back with another episode of Sky Factory 3. And today we are going to work a bit on automation. Now, what I would like to start doing is start automatically making dirt um, by... What I would like to do is put my leaves in a chest and have all those constant contents of a chest going into the barrel here. And then once this is done, going into another chest this way. I don't have to do it manually. Why? Because I'm lazy. <laughs> so let's get started. Now, uh, what I have done, if you noticed here, I have upgraded this to an iron stiffened mesh. So we still got the flint one there, but there's the iron one. Uh, and the reason why I did that was to put dust through here, which gave me a chance to get some redstone. So we got some redstone, we got some glowstone, gunpowder, uh, some blaze powder, and a whole bunch of iron. Let me put that here. And my inventory is full. But yeah, so what I want to try right now, now I haven't played around with it too, too much. And that's using the transfer pipes. Um, now we do have all the materials to build it. Uh, there we go. And I haven't used them myself yet. Uh, and we're also going to need the transfer nodes. Okay, I have that stuff. So I'm going to make a chest. Boop, boop. And let's see here. I think I could use that. And what was the last thing? Two redstone. Which I got. Boop, boop. Boop. And put that there. And I believe it was this here. Yes! Okay, so let's make two more chests. So we can put our items in here. There we go. Hmm, now where do I want to put this? I guess I could go right here for now. Yeah. It shouldn't be too hard to move. Okay. So we'll put that there. I'll grab you. Put you there. And let's grab you. Put you there. And I guess. If I put one going up, can I put you here? Yes, I can. Put you on top. And then. on top of that you there and there and there <laughs> hmm, I have a feeling I need a tool here creative wand wrench I might need that because I, I think there's supposed to be like arrows here or something like that or maybe I'm thinking of the conduits okay actually let me take a look at this because I haven't used it yet before I've done this before with uh, using um, uh, hoppers so I'd have a hopper here and a hopper here and it would work this is what I did in 2.5 but I haven't done this in three so let me take a quick look and I'll be back okay I think I got it now um I, I didn't need those transfer nodes on top so let's see if this works now let's put the rest of this in here basically if I want to make any dirt I just have to put everything in here and then it should start Come in. 
And I should take it out of this. There it goes. And there it is. Now I should be able to speed this up if I want to by spreading out the pipes into multiple barrels. Um, but I don't really need to do that now. Yeah, because what I would like to do, I was thinking I'd like to make kind of like a, a big floating island. Um, maybe with a castle on it. I definitely want like a waterfall like going down like a like a little hill or a mountain and just falling off into oblivion. Um, but I would like to do it out of mostly dirt and grass. So basically kind of like a big chunk of land has just lifted up into the air. And everything else is gone. <laughs> that That's just kind of what I'm, I think I want to do. Uh, and to do that, I need dirt. I'm going to need a lot of dirt. And looking here, I'm probably going to have to speed this up. But I know there's other ways to get dirt. But this is the only way I can do it right now. <laughs> I should also see if we can automate this. Actually, let's try it out right now. Um, so like I said, I'm still uh, fairly new with this mod pack and really mods in general. So thank you guys for being patient with me. Uh, let's see here. Um, I should, you know, extend this out more. So if I do that, and I'm assuming a pick would work. Oh, please. Okay. What if I put you there? Oh, oh, it does work. Yes. Yes, I, uh, I can be lazy. <laughs> okay, that is good. Okay, yeah, um, thank you guys for mentioning about, uh, the, what was it, or excavation mod, where I can actually hold down, what is it, the gravel key or something like that, which basically does that. Um, before I was actually trying to use shift, which I think is, um, vein miners button. Which does, which is not actually in this mod pack. So, oh sweet. So I'm glad that this is here. Now, I was looking if I can feed this into like a, a pulverizer or something like that, then I can actually start automating this part here and all that. All right. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pause here. I'm gonna let this run for a bit because I would like to maybe start uh, expanding this out a little bit more uh, maybe start working on either a farm or the mob farm but uh, yeah I'll be back okay so I was looking up this to see uh, how to make more dirt and really the only thing I could find was through composting so let us start with the mob farm now Unfortunately, like I've mentioned before, our base is kind of small, so we will have to extend it out a bit, and I will have to use this. Oh, is it? Okay. My bet. So, we'll have to use cobblestone for now, but we've got like a nice little grass platform. That and that. Uh, so for now, this will have to be fairly close to our base. And I haven't used fans before, so let us give a quick test on how to actually use them. So here's the recipe for that right now. And I need four. Do I even have four? Yes, I do. Two, three, four, and let us make some stone slabs. Doot, 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 doot. I'm assuming it needs to be activated by a redstone 
signal. So let, oh, let's do that and that. Whoa! Oh man, that is strong. So, okay, so it doesn't go up there. Mob fan modifiers. Oh, wait. Okay, no. Hmm. Max of three. Distance. Height. I don't think I need to worry about the height. I'm going to need to worry about the girth of it. <laughs> steel. I don't have steel. Okay. Uh, I should have a ton of that. Oh, no, I don't. Okay, so I can't upgrade it. Oh, the wonders of being poor. Okay, so I guess I'm gonna have to go the old-fashioned way. I have a feeling this is gonna destroy it. Nope! And that is to most likely use water. To push the mobs down. And I think I'm not too familiar with these guys. I think I'll use um, stone spikes. Wood spikes brings me down a half a heart. There's iron spikes. That's too expensive for me. That's too expensive for me. That's too expensive. This, this I can do. I can do this. So, huh. yeah. So let's see. Hmm. Well, I don't need. Um, I don't think I need to make it that high if they're going to be on the spikes. I think just standing on the spikes should destroy them. So, all right, let me gather up some materials and uh, let me try something out here. Okay, so once again, I am back. <laughs> um, I just got this simple, simple little building. That, that water there is just for me. Um, but I do want to test out. I think I will use this fan. It's not going to be perfect, but I just, yeah, so it won't get anybody over here. Won't get anybody over here, but if they do happen to walk in the center, it should get them. Actually, yeah, yeah, and then once I can get one upgrade, then that'll be fine. And I'm, I'm wondering, I have a feeling these take dirt. No, maybe they don't take durability. I don't know, but we'll put them down there. We'll see how they work. But I do want to see the range on this thing. And do I have... Yes, I do. So I'll put you there. Oh, it only brings me up to here. Hmm. Okay. So, two. there so let us put it right where that torch was Whee! <laughs> and I would have been dead so <laughs> so yeah I don't expect them to like really fall or anything like that and get fall damage but I am hoping that they, um, no, oh, oh man, uh, yeah, <laughs> I don't know why I did, I could have done it probably a different way, I do want them to go onto the spikes, that, that's the one thing I do want, so let's just take this off for now, put this here, and let's just, I don't care if I lose these, I get, uh, I get, oh wait, I don't want those gone. I don't care if I lose these, because, well, I kind of now have an unlimited number of them, which is great. So I want you gone. Just make sure that there's no connection. There, and, oh. I think the world is, I'm standing on this just in case. Gone. 
There we go. Okay. So I'm going to close this up and we will turn it on and see how it works. Oh yeah. And I'll put the spikes down there. I won't put a, a gathering thing just yet. I want to, I just want to see if it'll work. Hey guys, I am back and I have no idea why I have googly eyes. <laughs> I haven't killed anything or picked anything up as far as I know. So I don't know why my guy is so interested in everything. Boop, 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 boop. I don't even know how to take him off. But, oh well. I wonder if it's a hat or something. But yes, for some reason this thing is not working. I've tried different uh, methods and whatnot. I'm wondering if it's too close to my spawn point here. I built another little one. Just a tiny little room over here, and the mobs are spawning in this. Hey, he has googly eyes too! Hey, we're googly eye brothers! Take that! But, yeah, that over there is not spawning anything. So, that's the only thing I could think of is that it's too close. To base, and you know what? You guys probably already knew that. Uh, do I have my, uh, my bench? Is that on? But uh, yeah. Why are you? I should be the only one with googly eyes. So I'm gonna have to move this farther away from base. Uh, that's the only thing I could think of. Uh, with what's wrong with this so I will have to do that and I think I'll do that off camera just because well it took a while to actually build this <laughs> and testing out other methods to um, murder them and whatnot but let us kill a couple of these guys over here but yeah this this is like 30 blocks away from spawn and this is not that far so that must be the problem uh... I don't see any creepers in there yeah. come here smack it Can't get any of them. Um. Hmm. Could always pour lava in there to get rid of them. Or better yet, I want to try this. Okay, hold on. Okay, run for it. Oh. So long, suckers! Ah, man! <laughs> hey, why did that one not go? Oh, that might be there for a while now. <laughs> oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, there it is. there's my chest. Well, there goes that plan. I could always make a bow. That shouldn't be too hard to do, and all oh, arrows are gonna be hard. You live for now, guys. For now. <laughs> all right, well, anyways, guys, that's gonna be it for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. At least we did get this thing running and this thing running. So today wasn't a complete loss. <laughs> but anyways, guys, I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye. <laughs> okay. Now. Bye. <laughs> Wee. <laughs>